Welcome back to Pops and Pylons. Let's play some more Europe and Universalis 4. We're playing as Australia. We're going for Australia. Hungary. We have to unite Australia and we're super close. Our subject group in Jerry is about to be in next. And uh, then we just have to start to get Hungary if they still exist, if their core still exists, which I'm still afraid they don't. That's a lot of Australian and a lot of green around here. Australia? Yes, the other Australia. Austria. Please don't try to convert them away. Please. <laughs> I'll be very sad. Uh, we are not at war. We want to be at war again. We want to eat the Castilian Californians. We want to eat the Shoshone. Well, I drink because I care much about the Shoshone themselves, but because they are in the way of me suppressing the rebels over there. Um, and we also want to eat the Portuguese Cascadians. I don't think we have a claim yet, though. Oh, we also definitely wanted to click this bu these buttons. Yeah, yeah, we're just waiting for a tiny bit of loyalty, and then I just forgot. Let's run an agenda. Um, convert Miliao to Alchiringa. I mean, I, I want to do that anyway. Can you just tell me? No. Will you tell me here? Miliao. Well, they're on the Ixnay plan. It's a lot of nay. What kind of culture do you have in Miliao? Probably something I don't want to accept. Well, maybe. What are we talking about here? We're talking about Bornians. Bornians are not the tiniest. They're not the biggest. Should probably accept Filipino. There will be more Bornean in my country soon, because we're eating the Kotayans, right? I assume you're Bornean. Bornean, Bornean, but not a lot of development, granted. Bornean. You see, once we eat these, surely, surely there will be a lot of Bornean. So why don't we go and accept that right now? don't need to do it right now. We only need to do it when we start converting, which is not now. Corruption is going down, so technically we're going to save some money. Fine. Uh, if we were to do this, anyway. Uh, we get a half price in quiz. Ooh, now that's tempting. We get one hard conversion, but then we can actually convert hard. <laughs> uh, so that's interesting. Uh, Nobility wants me to have a ching. All provinces in the Kalimantan area. Which, I mean, I want to go for that, but maybe not right now. All the merchants give me half price trader, which is okay for trade power in Guangzhou Bay, which is easy to get, but well, assuming I have trade range game. Now I'm gonna go with the with the clergy here. We're gonna go and once our account conversions are done, one of them is we're gonna convert Miliao, and then uh, we're gonna do all the good stuffs there. Now I wanna nice. I uh, wanna build another one of these. And I did want to steal your land, didn't I? Estates, thanks for all the fish. I need land. I need it now. I mean gonna get it for that max absolutism. <laughs> and the yearly absolutism. Slowly making our way up here. Slowly. It's kind of hard to get a lot of max absolutism when you have estates with privileges, which makes some sort of sense. You know, it's it's not a bad game design choice as such. No, Mr. Hood. You did save us. Uh, save us? Yes, sure. Serve us. That's what I was trying to say for a long time. But he also saved us. Okay, we should see the annexation of Kutai in March. And then in April, we should see the annexation of these guys. And while I don't click this button, we should still be sitting on our Diplo rep. So we can wait one more month for the rest of the integration so it's not slowed down. Last times we had this happen, I went for a scooch toggling shenanigans and uh, Peter yelled at me for doing that. Rightfully so, rightfully so. 
So this time I'm going to play it right there. Go, second annexation. I'm going to take both of them. And... Uh, oh, the leader died. I didn't realize I was drilling somewhere. Oh, I wasn't. These are the guys we just integrated. One cog. One cog can join these 18 cogs. Six guys can, once they're allowed to, join these guys over here. On the monthly tick. On the monthly tick. There. Get to move. And then we ate you, so you can be here. What kind of boats do we steal? Galleys and cogs? Uh, there's probably some trade boats out somewhere. Ugh, waiting orders now. Galliots can join my combat fleet. Actually, upgrade galliots, that's nice. And you're joining there, okay. You are protecting the Molucas. Oh, maybe they did just keep their, their orders. That would be good. Uh, any navies without orders? Nine transports here. 18 transports. Yeah, these privateers that are just. Oh, Europe might not be. I'm mean, a privateer in Coromandel, that's fine. They're just they're giving me bar protection. Which is nice of them. Alright, subjects have been eaten. Which should mean I united my home region. I already did that earlier. Did I not click this button? Did this also give me autonomy change? Maybe. I feel like I already clicked this button before. Because we hadn't completed this yet, though. Do I still have a modifier going for autonomy drop? The blue rep? Yeah, I mean, like, yeah, there it is. Hegemonic ambition. Maybe we wait. Because you need to have land to reduce autonomy in for that to be worthwhile. And I might just not have that. What do we get here? Plus one colonist, which is great, but also useless right now. We have nowhere to colonize. Uh, control unrest. Uh, sure, that'll happen. I mean, it will happen. Okay, okay, okay. Not, not too shabby. What's that? Ooh, we're not quite there yet. Not quite. Hmm. Not spending the money on that. I do want to punch these for good reason. I'm gonna fight the Kiowa, but surely that's not a problem. We have none tech, which is the best tech for enemies to have. That is. Let's just go punch him. Uh, let's also go spy on the Portuguese. Do you have a bunch of claims on the Castile? Not that many. Thought I had more. I'm gonna build another spine rock here. I know I have other decks to go in, but this is just so juicy. I wanna, wanna do it. Gain a corruption, promote the interest. Mm, I remember that we came to that, but I lose prestige. I don't like losing prestige right now. I want my prestige. Oh, I'm so close to sixth. Such nice prestige. Is there a prestige button I could press? So many. Buttons. I could press. You don't get prestige, right? No. And you also don't get prestige. And I don't think there's an instant prestige button here. Although <laughs> we could catch divination for some reason. Mm hmm. No, I don't think I can just generate prestige. I actually. Oh, do this. It paints me. Prestige is so cheap usually, and corruption is so ugh. But I can't have it right now, I just can't. Uh, let's try to generate some prestige with you. Wait, do I have military access? I do. I did ask for it. Let's not have military access. Let's have a bunch of cores though, that's good. Uh, yeah. Yep. 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 Sure. Yep. Really wish. Oh, we can have. Exp um, 
what their face guys right conquistadors we should after we've done this war we should send out a conquistador we should do it now just just do it don't hesitate recruit a conquistador eh? looks terrible but good enough and wait we can hunt no the button is grayed out right can't hunt let's check that it's true yeah the whole capital in the colonial regions thing again i didn't realize i was playing the same campaign as i was last time but apparently i am apparently i am oh we need years for this guy to come home well days but still same difference that's a lot of why, why particulars and where particulars is more the interesting question uh they're over here mostly except that bang kulu and potentially hollow y might be big Let's try bang kulu is 11 and holla hall hawaii is not is it no no it's not bang kulu Might want to go and do something about the Bengalians. How much unrest do you have? Six? That's a lot of unrest. Freaking English? Mm. I guess these Spaniards are not scary anymore. Okay. Grab you and get you over to Bengalu. At least then I know where the enemy is going to spawn. Okay, with Tip or Huddle being done, we want to start on Meliao for the quest. And to do that, we need to accept the Bornians. Which we shall. And then Meliao should at least be accessible here. Yeah, 52 is still long, but that's not Meliao. That's Meliao. Kalimantan, Enforce. Do it. It's gonna be hard work, but once it's done, we should be having, having a much easier time doing the rest. So that's nice. Do you have a diplomat yet? No. Sorry, can't tell you we're at war and busy. Guy's busy traveling. Can't send one of these folks. Or just send the army in without telling them no. That's, that's impossible. Here we go. Declare war. Take quack 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 quack. Wait, half? No, that's not it. Where is Kalapuya? Kalapuya. Huh. Wait, that's Castilian Californians. <laughs> Game? <laughs> so I doubt I can actually take Kalapuya because it's not theirs. But I mean, who knows? Are you getting away? Oh, you're just you're dancing a lot and still getting away? How much maneuver do you have? None? You're crazy. You're so crazy. Let's leave a guy and chase these fudges down. If I have to chase you all through Alaska. See? Gotta catch ya, catch ya, catch ya. I'm gonna crush ya, crush ya, crush ya, right? Uh, start. Immediate colonization, even though we don't know where the other... Oh, there's the other enemy. Gotta be slightly careful with our conquistadore. Oh, this is um, not close, though. And we're now ruthless. If you have to be less than something, it might as, might as well be ruth. Um, speaking of ruthlessness, definitely gonna wanna at least build one cannon around here for these sieges. Hmm, didn't have a guy there, but good enough anyway. Crunched. 
Now you can maybe go and find some other place with unrest. You could be over there. Should probably look for something that's extra rebelling though. Castilian Californian, 16 thou. It's a lot of them, sire. And then Bruniads and Palawan. Okay, so you folks go to Palawan then. But how do we deal with 16 thou Castilians? I mean, I have 16,000 folks here. So we just run out a few more frontier riflemen. We have actually decent use for them once um, once the rebellion is dealt with. Because it works. Good reason, right? Um, because we're gonna need somebody to sit on all the sit on all the colonies we're gonna start. Like Matini Whack. Go. Let's explore north because south seems kinda scary right now. Uh do I care about Banjar? Production here is I mean, not useless. Rebellion is actually, yeah, I'm gonna send you the 100 ducats. Not sure I'm gonna make the money back, but it seemed kind of scary not to do that. Okay, a bunch of frontier riflemen, excellent. Did you just move into the place I was trying to colonize? Oi. They did, right? No, 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 we're going here and here, okay. Never mind. Because that would have been rude. Uh, yeah, stop the... Stop the, stop the sub. Sub? Sure. Subression. Just meet over here and then resub. 90% of the Castilian Californian stuff. Well, they're gonna be in Castilian California, aren't they? I mean, it's surprising, I know, but I'm actually not ready for that. Um, guys, I'm um, you back there. Start. Yeah. Way in the south, too. Oh, goody. Makes sense because we had um, the rise up happened there before. But oh man. So how do we do this? We transfer, yeah, 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 I know, I know. Transfer over here and then we land in, I think, Ukom. Ukom Nom? Seems good enough. Uh, no, you're using the wrong fleet, aren't you? Uh, you probably used these. Ladies, yeah, who were actually sitting over here? Don't do that. The auto transport is not always the absolute smarts. I mean, sure, there's sense to using a fleet that's big enough. I get that, but if the transportation takes longer than the <laughs> And um, moving the boats there takes a lot longer than the multi-way transportation would take, then that's probably not a great way to do it. Wait, you came out? Yeah, it's back in. And attach, get out here. Well, are we gonna make it before the siege take? Ah, I think we did actually. Not sure. Wanted to um, actually help with the blockading there. Siege is the thing it's looking for. Go run there, crush him, leave a guy to take Oloni back, and then we go back north. Oh, that's the plan at least. People learning about stuff. Maybe somebody will eventually tell me about Hungary. That would be nice. Just so I can soothe my 
uh, mind, I suppose. Let's call it a mind. Wait, how do you stop? You didn't stop, did you? No. It's just that we finally arrived in Danny's. Ah! And we won the siege of Quack 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 Quack. Which means uh, we probably want to start moving into Ashenau uh, using my transports. Took back Oloni, good. Come north. Uh, oh, we want more buildings. More buildings, please. Manufactories out the wazoo. Two of them. I mean, I want to buy those Chinook officers. <laughs> Apparently, very, very good martial education in Chinook. Ah, that's too many ducats. Nah, I'm not going to do it. The prestige was so close. Just let me get that prestige. And we need the prestige for upgrading our government rank, which we've been waiting for for a while. Oh, what's this then? Gain two base manpower on Matiginiwak. Fur. Do we know what Matiginiwak is? Oh, they have cows. Yeah, okay, for fur. Just, just, just gonna take the mid power, sure. Let's say that's worth it. Oh, we won the Battle of Ashi. That. Got land fire damage, which I do like. I'm gonna keep exploring here, but soon we're gonna move him over to the real army. So the army can move through enemy territory. Into. But through unknown territory here, into Kiowa. They should be able to do that. Make that move. Also. Look at these guys. They're just screaming to be killed. Begging? Sure. That too. Screaming and begging. Olo me. Uh, there should be other places like some that's a very good place to convert. Sambalyung. Sambalyung. Katai. And fours and deer. Where are you going? Kill what? Tsutina. Excellent. Come my way, please. Wait, oh, even locking into the Sequum Sequum which is also good for me. There you go. Uh, we arrive next month, right? Yeah, easily. So we can wait for one reinforcement tick and ship consolidate. And then go crunch and crunch again. Crunch once. Let them lock into... <laughs> Ktunaksa? Ktunaksa? Ktunak... I don't know. There you go, lock in, crunch, 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 do it. What's this tech then? What's all this then? Furnace, wait, we don't know what coal is yet. <laughs> don't know what an enlightenment is, but we do certainly want it. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna take tech 21 here. It also gets us a head of time bonus, which is uh, actually nice. We get production efficiency, which for us is a lot of money, and corruption reduction, which for us is <laughs> You know, relevant. And I guess I might as well pick up on these. Sabotage reputation. These are the things that are just there. At least it feels like they're just there to help the AI against the player. It's essentially useless for me to sabotage anybody's reputation. But it's very, very annoying if the AI sabotages mine. Uh, you got black flag there, of course, because um, 
percent chance of unrest in Sambal Young. Oh, we get less taxes. No, no, less taxes. That's fine. There we go. Government rank. Go, go, go. Also, oh, we were already king. I thought it was still Dutch. Anyway, we're gonna become an empire. We're gonna get the cultural union of the original, and it's gonna be very good. All of these folks here will be accepted cultures. Excellent. Very good. And now we don't need to care so much about prestige anymore, which is also very good, because that annoyed the heck out of me. You, I don't think you should do anything here. You can just sit. Well, can't suppress anything relevant right now. Might as well get a start, though. Uh, speaking of starts, how are we doing on diplomats? Yeah, yeah, yeah look at that. I want a claim on you, on Tsunuk. Uh, I would like a claim on you, but I can't yet, right? No. I think we can do Portuguese Cassidia immediately again. Second place we know about. If we knew about this place, we could do more, but we don't. So I guess we can't. So come home. And then you... Oh, best choice. So join me. Uh, I don't want to grant anything here. Uh, do you have... You have some influence, but they're not going to gain influence here, that's good. Mm. They all like us about the same. I'd rather do Stiplo than Atman. So I'm going to do that. What are all these galleys? You just want to be merchant. I'm just going to clean up the fleets a little bit. So I'm not as confused. But I guess this is it. Oh, you're protecting Malacca. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Malacca's it's the place to be. That's where the money is at. I know the Shoshone one out soon. Soon. I just need to make my way over here. Unfortunately, while we don't own Sixikawa, we can't start colonizing this, or we complete the colonization of Matiniawak. Kind of stuck a little bit there. Um, could revoke a clergy thing, actually. Do I want to do that? How's your equilibrium? Oh, it's very good, actually. I think I'm just going to drop the Clerk Advisory Council. I can right now. Hmm. Does that hit my conversion speed on the I'm negative with the clergy? It might. Maybe we don't do it immediately. Because I do want to complete the conversion as fast as possible so we can actually start on the other thing. Uh, I also want a fairy cat and hunter moot. And I want to consider finding a way to attack Hadra Mood without also fighting Hormuz and Adal. And I believe it was Adal who was kind of... Oh no, they're both kind of happy to be in there right now. Hormuz is in debt, but otherwise... Happy. Um, Andres in Mechanesia, or... Just too much money for 25% reduced create project upgrade cost. I need to spend what 4,000 ducats on great project upgrades in the next 10 years to get my money back. I mean, that great project is not not interesting, it's like a colonization one, wasn't it? There. None at all. Settle increase, settle increase, more settle increase. I don't think it's worth it though right now. We have so many good things to spend money on. Oh, I can't steal the none at all. I'm just gonna take the two on rest, which are gonna be which are gonna be irrelevant. 
It's just a no to taking the upgrade cost reduction for a price, and a high price, nonetheless. Nonetheless? Sure. Uh, Edward Algomar died. That's okay. He was okay, but he was a little old too. Uh, where are these Portuguese separatists at? Because we don't want to have those. Oh, they're going to be extremely annoying, aren't they? Mohe is seven development. Kokos Island is three, and Christmas Island is seven. So Mahe or Christmas Island for now. Once we find something bigger in Mentawai or Nias. Mentawai. Menta. Oh, it's you. That's five. Nias. That was tiny. Three. So it's either on Cocos Island or uh, on Christmas Island or way over on Mahe. That's annoying. Uh, I can't really just increase up. I mean, I can. Increase autonomy, though I don't, I don't wanna. Because that would... Mm, cost me absolutism, which I absolutely don't wanna. So instead, what are we gonna do? We have these guys whose suppression is irrelevant. So I could grab the 30th fleet and use that to move you over to, say, Christmas Island. And then ideally we're gonna be able to just pop them. Okay, they're running away to some place we don't know. What is the direction? Okay, it's just away. Oh, hello. I guess I shouldn't really have been able to see that they're staging there, but I was. I'm gonna take all the information I can get. So let's leave siege stack here and send the rest to there. We're overconfident. It's gonna be painful when fighting the separatists here. Also, my they spawned a lot faster than intended. And I didn't give you a general, did I? This is gonna be slightly rough. I think we're gonna land in time. We do, but it's painful. Uh, autonomy in Noble Land, or 50% chance for revolts in Mangala, or nothing. I think the Noble Estate always loses 15 loyalty in this way, though. I don't care about Mangala. Fine, let's slide. Hate giving away land like that, but... What is a man to do? Subjugate, subjugate, siege... Maybe crunch? And they should see me coming, I should have the ability to run away there. When Laka likes me, death cost reduction goes produce modifier, we just get trade power and trade power and Pangasi then. Which is a place where trade power... It's not particularly relevant. Most of the money is already going my direction. So I'd probably rather have this then. Painful. But they got crushed. Who else is rebelling? Bruneins and Palawan. But we're sitting on them, right? We're not quite sitting on them, but mostly. Can you... do you have a shot at getting out of there? No, right? Oh, you do. But there's no real unrest over there. Hmm. Don't know if that's smart. It's probably not smart. Focus on this place. You guys... are you already focusing here? No, you're not. No, you are. 
here on Passer, which is this place. I mean, I have an army sitting on both. It'll be fine. Do I have a general for you? I do not. It's also gonna have to be fine. Come on! Find those natives. Find them and crush them. They're not here anymore. Not a surprise. Uh, I did what they asked me to, right? Just completed my thing. Yeah. There we go. So now we can buy the half price missionary strength person. And start converting heavily. Cebu Surabaya, very interesting. Skwul Mesh is also interesting. A lot of places. Let's start in Surabaya. Surabaya. Enforce and do it. You know what else we're gonna do? We're gonna put a cut in here. Thank you folks so much for watching. If you do enjoy what you're seeing, then uh, please do consider hitting that like button, subscribing if you're not subscribed yet, and uh, telling me pretty much anything you wanna tell me down there in the comment section. Thank you folks for watching and see you next time.